Venom airspace. All right, time to get to Venom. Like so, a million times before. So with this Venom stage, you don't actually like fly anywhere. You pretty much like end up right at Venom's uh, Say your prayers, right across his, uh, my main base. Oh yeah, we're already at the final battle, dang. And then did you just skip the whole thing? Don't get Star Wars. Star Wars here. Oh no, let's run by how you handle our new ship. So they come in like better ships this time. They actually are a bit of a challenge. Uh, chunk shots don't work on them at all. That sucks. So you pretty much have to just like, like fire. And those damn towers in the way. And everyone's gonna need help cons like constantly. You guys don't give up. Come on. Of course we're not going to give up. That is really like Team Starfire. Oh, got him. Yes. We have a couple of people with some tired freaking universe. Oh, shit. Uncle Andros, I failed you. I'm useless. So you do your, and then he does his. Huh. I can't shake this guy. Yeah, you're it. One more Oh, I need this health, though. Because I don't want to lose my wing. I, uh... Lasers. Fuck! This oh shit. So it's down to Star Fox or Star Wolf rather, so. The thing about the charge shot, it can usually like get them off of your uh, teammates. Yeah. Ooh, he is on top of you, isn't he? Yeah, no, he is like super aggressive on the stage. But that's alright. Probably they also do the barrel roll. <laughs> yeah. Kinda makes it a little more difficult when they can just deflect, but. Can I get him? Wait for it. Get a couple. Ugh. Oh. You're close. You're looking for these damn towers. The party's just begun. Go right. I see you've got new ship. Yep. Okay, you weren't in trouble. I just saw you. Where did he go? It's a downside of having gigantic stages. Got it. There we go. And oh. I get the super health out of it. Alright, so Summer Saw doesn't really work, so you have to kinda of like try and break it. And then he's just an asshole about it. <laughs> but I'm better. Oh, oh god, I'm glad better. I breaked. Got me a dick. We just need to blow you up. Ah, nope. Damn it. Before it. Oh, shit. He's tough. Yeah, it makes it a little bit more difficult when you can't walk onto it. That's alright, because my favorite fight in any game is the guy that's the same size as you. Yeah, it's, he's always the most difficult. That's how you know you're in trouble. Wait for it. And some salt. I he did U-turn. That was good. The AI for this fight is so much better than all the other ones. No good. Wait for it. Yes. Yeah, it actually kind of shows. Got it. There you go. Yes! Down! So I have my high believe which is good, but I can just as easily lose him in the next part of the stage. Also, I lost a lot of lives. Yeah, you're really low on health. I was gonna mention that, like... Uh, this next part is a maze. Uh, different ways you take will give you different power-ups. If I can get a way that has a gold ring, I'll be set. Yeah. Otherwise, I may not be able to do this in one shot. Gold rings are definitely... Silver ring will be nice, but a gold ring will be perfect. Wasn't there something that increases the amount of overall uh, life you have? Whenever you can get three gold rings. Oh, okay. So I'm at two now, so... Okay. Do you still remember the uh, direction you gotta go? Do not! <laughs> I was never actually good at this part. Bombs are kinda useless. Some ways are actually faster than others, like you just go like almost like straight to them. Andros, that's dirty. Now you will feel... Come on, man. Hey, use lube with that kind of talk. This is getting weird. Damn it, alright. I didn't get it. That's fine, though. You can do it. Hey, just as long as I don't get eaten, I should be fine. Oh, man, as long as... Big old monkey head! Oh, really weird liver-spotted monkey head. I, mean, I never really understood the liver spots. Yeah, there's a ton of them. I mean, I'll be honest with you, as long as he kind of... <sighs> As long as he spits on that finger before he tries to use it on you, then... So I'm gonna make a lot of, like, close noises. <laughs> Be a big one. Right at the rooter. Oh, no, 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 no. He kind of looks like my grandma. Like, before she passed away, that old Asian lady face. <laughs> Which is weird. Oh, help, 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 help. One's good. That helped. Punch. Oh wait, what am I doing? Shoot him in the eye. Shoot him in the eye so he goes. No, no, no! I don't wanna! I don't wanna! I don't wanna! No! Oh god! Oh, what am I doing? 
There you go. Now you can shoot in the eyes. No! Oh, bomb. I'll take it. Get one of those down his throat, King of Dongo style. No, don't want, don't want it, don't want it. No means no. <laughs> this is Andros we're talking to. He does not take no for an answer. Hey, you have to shoot him in the head just enough so he goes into his final form. Ooh. Which is an insane Oh, board. weird. So, this part's cool, but it can be tough because he fucking teleports all over the stage. I like that it's all range mode, though. That's helpful. Because, like, a final fight should be in all range mode. <laughs> Especially if you fucking introduce it, like, in this part of the game. Yeah. So, woo! Oh, fuck. That was creepy. I'm gonna have nightmares about that. Yeah, no kidding. Nightmare fuel there, definitely. Plus the brain so, with giant tentacles. Ugh. Oh, fuck. All right, boost, use some distance. All right, so you can take out the eyes, and that helps a little bit. Oh, shit. Good if I can take out the eyes, oh, this is going to be way too close. Need distance. He's got another eye right on top of you. Yeah. Uh, both of them are right, like, right on. Ah. Okay. Um. Nope. Break. 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 <laughs> break. 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 Ah! Got it. There we go. That's One a good position to be on this probably. Oh no. Oh, I didn't destroy it. That's so close. Oh. oh, I can't believe I'm still alive. Yeah, that is kind of ridiculous. I really wish Slipper was here only so I could have a shield and someone to take these hits. <laughs> and they're both right behind you. Damn it! Oh, there you went. Alright, that's fine. Uh, you have to do that part over though, so maybe I can actually get the hyper beams again or the extra life. Well, at least you'll have more health. Uh, which way did we go last time? Was left, right, left? Yeah, I believe it was left, right, left. Yeah. No. Right, so we're already half a I Really, just having this is good enough. Yeah, that helps. I don't helps. need the hyper beam. Oh, I saw I even have more bombs. You yeah, actually shoot the bomb into his mouth while he's sucking in and actually, like, kind of help yeah. stall him. That seems like it'd be something that would be very effective in this Uh, now you will heal. Just want to see if there's anything different. Seriously, Andros, all you gotta do is. Oh, no, this was the way I took it. Yeah. Hyper beam, I'll take it. Uh, hey, it helps. Like, all he's really gotta do is just kind of. Spit on it before he laughs. Just get some oil or something, man. It's, I mean, get some personal lubricant, Kentucky jelly. There we go. One in the eye. One in the eye. How you like them bananas? Oh shit! Your lasers are so fucking useless, though. Fr Freaking finger lasers. And it's no special beam cannon. <laughs> Eyeball. So that's not the first time Fox probably shot it in the eye. Oh, both of them. And I super fast. Yep, bomb. There you go. Boom. Oh, he's loving it. He's loving it. You like that spicy beat ball? Oh, he just loves it right in the face. Look at All that. Right. Look at that big right, This finish. time it's on. Yeah, now you gotta This is the real fight. fight. The previous one was a dream fight. Right. Now you can do it. It'll take a mulligan on this one. Things like this in Resident Evil, I don't understand why villains transform themselves into huge, ugly-ass monsters. How are you gonna, like, do anything? Yeah, why would you transform yourself into nothing but a brain and eyeballs? Boost. That's and weird. And let's turn around. Alright, Well, maybe that's fast. not what he's transforming himself into. Maybe that's just his fetch. Maybe that's his thing. He just really feels like that on the inside. Oh, that's one eye down. It's almost like tentacle form. Yeah, it is kind of very reminiscent of 10 Got it. All right. too. That's how the fight's supposed to go. There you go. This yeah, is there better. you go. Now you just gotta take out that big, freaking creepy floating brain. You can only hit that big, like, weird tumor on it to hurt it, though. Ah, okay. Hypothalamus. Kazoom type. Also, oh, he teleports this right weird. behind you. Sometimes he'll even try and teleport on you. Oh, oh. Weird. Oop. Well, you could. 
You know, if you spank him hard enough, make him call you dad. I had a daddy, and he killed him. <laughs> really? Fox Senior. Dead. Oh yeah, that's right. Rip in peace. Wait for it. Ooh. That was something. Oh shit! There he's in front of you again. Just... Is too bad you can't fire those things just directly behind you. Waiting for it. Y'all yeah, yeah, really aren't going anywhere. That's there we right. go. There we go. And that's how it's done. That's how you shoot a giant brain in space. Right? That kind of made me a little, you know, sickly because all the spinning. That <laughs> yeah. would definitely get you. Get a little you motion sick. The fox is all like, ah, the eyeball penetrated my bee hole. <laughs> Don't ever give up, my son. <laughs> I'm much cooler than you'll ever be. Right. Is it because you're wearing Honor? sunglasses, Dad? Yeah. Yes. That's that the, is the only difference reason. between us. So when you get all the medals in all the worlds, you can start the game over on expert Bottom mode. Box. Stops a lot harder. And you take like twice as much damage. Uh, in expert mode, Fox wears those glasses. Oh, very cool. Smooth so operator. So you have to be boosting at this point. You just can't just follow him. Yeah. You have to boost, otherwise the smoke will catch up again. Oh. Actually, I don't know that for true. But the smoke's really annoying. You can't see where your dad's going. You have to follow him out of here. Yeah, that's true. Also, you can accidentally go past him too, and then be really lost. <laughs> Never give up. Oh, that hurts. Nope, that hurts. Yeah, don't ping pong nope. your way out of this thing, man. Yeah, that just won't end well. Oh. There you go. Nope, nope. 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 Falling down. Falling down. Man. So you know, it isn't that ah oh, crap. Left or right? Left. Oh. Damn it. Alright, it isn't just me, like, the, the stage is actually, like, controlling really hard. Yeah, it looks like it's shifting you around a little bit. Yeah. Follow me, Fox. Basically, it's like the space stage is moving around while my ship is being still. Mm. Luckily, I still keep the, uh, damage, uh, the point bonus I got from, uh, Andros, so... That's neat. So, I guess it's cool that I die here at the last minute and totally don't end this like a cool guy. It's reminded me so much of the ending of the first Halo. Oh. Just because they did the exact same thing with like a Warthog chase scene, though. Oh, yeah, that's right. God. Oh, that was really fun. It really sucked a lot of the... Like, I, I wasn't very good at it, so... I mean, it was kind of a fun moment, but it sucked some of the, like... Oh, my God, I just beat the boss out of it because I had to do that like four times in a row. The best one that does it is uh, Metal Gear Solid 3. Because you do the chasing away from the base with everyone shooting at you. And then you do the best boss fight in the game. That's cool. And that order makes the difference. Yeah, I imagine it would. Alright, there you go, that's how it's done. And time. No, I'm kidding. This is no speed run. So this. Strong, <laughs> Thanks, weird ghost dad. Bye, ghost dad. I'll see you for your ghost birthday. Is is Star Fox is he mentally ill? He seems to be seeing a lot of his dead father. Well he's going at like a whole bunch of G's all the time, so there's probably a lot of blood rushing to his head. He's probably seeing things. What's happening in subtle games now? So if you let everyone die in the Star Wars fight, no one will be up here to greet you. <laughs> Good. Just like real life. Right? <laughs> Don't let all your friends die. But also, if you teamed up with other people, like in the game, like a builder or cat, who show up in uh, different missions, they'll also be floating Nothing around here wrong. too. Or not, depending on if they survive. Can Bill die? I don't think he can. Bill, Bill and Cat don't have light bars in their stages. Who's Bill again? Bill's the dog that's in uh, Katina. The Independence Day stage. Okay. And Cat's the uh, cat that's in love with uh, Falco. Oh yeah, that's a weird relationship, a cat and a bird. I well, mean, uh, it's, don't it's judge Judy and Nick belong together. It's you know, it's a new day and age though. I'm gonna accept it, but it's just... sometimes he isn't just totally cracked out on mushrooms. Sometimes he just really likes space. <laughs> Takao Shimizu, I don't know who you are. But I'm staring right into your soul. Right. <laughs> So this is Star Fox 64. I love this game. This, this is the game I spent most of my 64 days playing. Yeah. Because I wasn't the kind of guy that could play Star Fox, or not Star Fox, uh, Ocarina of Time over and over again. Yeah. And I didn't own Ogre Battle. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but Ogre Battle was so much fun. It is fun. It's a game you can play over and over again. I didn't have it. <laughs> Star Fox 64 was a lot of fun too, though. Well, question, do, do, do you have it now? Maybe. Maybe I do. It's not hard to get, but it's it's kind of like playing a mobile game nowadays. But it, it could just it, be so it play, much... It plays itself. <laughs> it does. Honestly. And we can all enjoy it. That's a good podcast game. Yeah, yeah. Something that goes in the background. 
Woo, there's the planet we saved, I'm assuming. Totally not Earth. Hello, Cornera Earth. Thanks, Yakuhisa Yamamura. Now to Yakuhisa. overthrow the oligarchy. <laughs> the oligarchy. God damn it. You know what this reminds me of? Star Wars? Well, no, that Skynet is going to destroy us all. But yeah. Why Skynet? Why not? The singularity in general, you know, any kind of apocalypse involving technology. Because you see that ship? That ship could destroy this planet. Technically, yeah. I mean, well, we proved we're already better than the entire army put together. Yeah. Yeah. There's nothing that can stop anyone. Really, if we weren't here, Star Wolf could come and just, like, take over. Considering I that, I bet these people are terrified that you're just flying overhead. Right? Well, no, they're busy cheering because, like, yay! Yay, our super non-oppressed mercenary team that has no allegiance to anyone except money. Has killed the giant crazy space monkey for the fifth time. For the for the second this first is the time. Second time. Second Third first time. Well, no, they, it's weird. they might be what? messing around it's... with the freaking time frame like they do with Metroid. I don't know. I don't care what anyone says. Prime is canon. This is some really cool music. Uh huh. Uh huh. Hey, this was voice acting before voice acting was uh, like a big thing. <laughs> I understand. Slash gotta... Metal Gear Solid. That's yeah. really that's really where I count voice acting really taking a huge like jump. Ah, Buck. Oh, we are shut up. in your debt. I would be honored to have you as part of the Cornerian. Oh no, sir. Nope. We prefer doing things our own. Yeah. Way. Fuck you. Pay me. Team Cap. <laughs> Great box. Hey, sometimes we need to be to where they may not want us to be. It's and then what do we do, to Tony? Now. What do we do? <laughs> We're gonna shit all over their army. So, did y'all watch the uh, Star Fox anime at that since y'all? No. Well, I, you didn't know. No, I didn't even know you sent me one, man. I sent it on the Facebook. Oh, that's cool. Oh, I didn't notice that. All right. Well, y'all should watch it when you get a chance. It's kind of cool. It's done by the Attack on uh, Titan animation team. Oh, that's exciting. And it's only like uh, like 12 minutes long. Short and sweet. Oh. Well. Okay. Anyway, it actually like kind of like really like fits the characters pretty well. And Peppy's more of a hard ass and he is kind of like an old fart. Yeah, I think hard ass Peppy would be much better than old fart Peppy. You know, if... If Falcon and Fox keep running at the same pace that they are, they're gonna leave Peppy and Slippy behind. Well, Peppy's gonna have a heart attack and just fall over, and Slippy's just gonna trip on himself. I was about to say herself. Probably on on Peppy. <laughs> you know you're right. I could definitely see him going down and taking the other one with him. <laughs> just because like he doesn't want to suck alone. That seems like something they would definitely do. Fox and Falcon need to quit Star Fox and form their own F Zero racing team. Mm -hmm. I agree. Man, I miss F Zero. <laughs> Didn't they remake it? No. No, that's a game we're never gonna get another one of. Makes me sad. Really? Minamaru Ito, the Super Mario Club. Special thanks. Oh, please, just leave Slippy behind. Nah, he's gonna keep up. Unfortunately, he has no. to build more upgrades for us. He, he has to be there to talk to us while we go visit Dinosaur Planet. He's the one who's got a dozen machines. <laughs> What? <laughs> he does machines. Oh, God. Falco's crude but cool. Yeah. And Peppy's a party dude. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. My childhood is just now destroyed. Thank you. And Crystal is the Venus of the group. Yeah, God, that was a terrible turtle. We're, -da. we're about to be done here, okay? And we're going to end it on that terrible note. 1997 Nintendo. That was a good year. I was 10 years old. Fuck, we were. Yeah. Holy crap. Yeah. Man, we were terrible at games when we were 10 years old. Thank yep. you for just kind of throwing my age into my freaking face. Oh no, it's all of our ages. About 20 years ago now. Ugh. Good timestamp on this, by the way. Right? <laughs> Mmm. Congratulations, D. Alright, back up. No, I'm gonna leave it. This is one Hey! Uh -huh. They are gonna pay you. Yep. 67,000. Nice. That's Star Fox 64. We're glad you. We hope you enjoyed it. I'm glad you got to watch it. I wish I could have done better. Join us next time as we start Star Fox Assault. <laughs> Assault. Game's ass! Yeah! Oh god. This is just gonna end so terribly.